Lee Smith. And Jane Johnston from Blood and Iron Martial Arts. Today we are reviewing the Destroyer Mods Gorget. It's pretty awesome. I actually really like it. Our first impressions are pretty positive. I mean, it doesn't choke me, which is the first Gorget I've worn that does not. I guess we'll call it Gorget or throat protection. <laughs> I mean, it's extremely light and it dries quickly. For us, my first impressions of it. Yeah, when we first got this, we were both really excited. We were super stoked, like waiting for it to come in, and then it came in and we tried it on, and right away, as soon as we put it on, like favorite piece of gear, because it's so comfortable, you forget that you're wearing it. Even underneath a jacket, you don't really feel it. It just kind of becomes part of you, and it doesn't mess up the way you move at all. So going into it, we were really excited, and we loved this guy right off the bat. So the break-in. There's none. I mean, it's unlike any of the other Hema Gorgets in the market where you would have the stiffer AF style gorget that goes around your neck, chokes you a lot. You know, you're gonna want that to soften up, especially for a term, you're wearing that for a solid month, trying to get that to give you enough breathing room so it doesn't restrict your airways. This, zero, put on, go to work. It's the best. It really is. Things we like. So for me, it's super, super comfortable. You don't even notice that you're wearing it. Um, I like that there's a piece of hard protection on it and that it does have a lip to kind of catch any thrust that's coming up. The Velcro, super sturdy, nice long piece. So it's not just gonna get all matted and gross and eventually just die out on you and keep falling off. So it stays on really well. It's really comfortable and it fits a variety of sizes. So for me, it pretty much covers all the bases. Honestly, I think it's great for guys like myself with a big thick ass neck. And little baby necks. It fits both of us really well. Yeah, which is really strange. Normally, some people will hate one gorget and like another, but this is great for me. It doesn't dig into my jaw connector. I mean, over the throat protection I've worn over the years, everything from steel guards to heavy leather ones, this is like easily the most comfortable. So I love this. It's a simple design. A very, very simple design. And as a result, if, let's say, something happens, someone she loses her gorget, I can trade this off to Jane, she can wear it, no problem. So you can transfer between teammates in a pinch. Also excellent. Super lightweight, sweat doesn't accumulate too much, I mean. I can... Oh, it's breathable like nobody's business. <laughs> so it's also good, very light. I like the lip, I like the design. I mean, it's definitely a good product. So in terms of things we'd like to see changed, for me the big one is just a more sturdy construction. There's just a little bit of string on either side kind of affixing the hard plate to the soft part. Mine within a few weeks had already fallen off on one side. It just kind of broke and came off. It's a really easy fix, but I'd like to see something a little bit more sturdy there. And I'd also like to see this part nailed down. Because one of the things that can happen with this gorget is this pops up and then you just have this, which isn't necessarily a hard piece of foam. And because of that, it can sometimes damage you. That being said, I've taken thrusts on the hard plate and barely even noticed them because it's that good. So I really like this gorget. My one big thing is I just want a sturdier construction and more kind of pinning this down so it doesn't pop up. I can't really disagree with that. It's pretty, uh, pretty reasonable. The other thing I'd like to see is maybe this, this on the flares here. Bent in just a little more. I mean, I'm really, I'm really picking straws here because this is a good product. Um, so, and, and the same change as Jane recommended. Overall, I give this, I think this is probably the best, best throat protector I've used in terms of all things considered, cost, flexibility, um, easy to maintain, I mean, lightweight. It's actually a really good product. So I don't hesitate. I give it two thumbs up. I think it's the best piece on the, piece of throat protection on the market for the price. Yeah, the price is really good. It was like 45 USD, maybe 50 from Purple Heart, and it's easily accessible. You can get it through Purple Heart. They'll ship pretty much anywhere, which is really nice. I love this gorget. Overall, it's my favorite gorget. It's like a dream to wear because you don't even know you're wearing it. It protects really well, but I can't give it two thumbs up because for me, a product that has a few little nitpicky things, eh. Like, I can fix these things. I can do my own little mod to make this stay down, and I can toughen up the strings here, but for me to give a product a two thumbs up, I'd like that to just be done. So I give this one and a half thumbs up. One and a half, because it's so close to being perfect. You and I love it, so. Cut one of your thumbs off. Don't you cut my thumb off? That's just rude. Anyway, <laughs> he gives it two thumbs up. I give it one and a half thumbs up. It's a really, really good gorget, and I do think it's better than pretty much anything else on the market right now. No. Chop, chop. You stop that. Anyway, bye bye now, before we cut <laughs> off my thumbs. 